Yo, what's up, YouTube? This is your boy, Junior, a.k.a. Smoking Guns out here in Tucson, Arizona, representing the Ultimate Trainer. So, today's video, this is going to be part four of my intermittent fasting series, and this is a commonly asked question that I do get asked, and this is, is it safe to work out? in a fasted state and what are the benefits of working out in a fasted state now when I first delved into working out in a fasted state I remember when I was in prison back in 2014 and I remember when they would open up the yard at 5 30 in the morning me and the homies would meet up go out to the yard and we jump rope for 20 minutes in a fasted state and I used to feel great dude my energy levels were optimal and the main reason I got into it is because I was reading up on it and it stated how working out in a fasted state aided in the process of fat burning. Now, I never lifted weights in a fasted state, though. And while I was in prison, I would do my friggin' fasted cardio 5.30 in the morning. And that is also when I got into the feast fast method, where I would have a cheat day, and then the next day, I would fast anywhere for 18 to 24 hours. Now, I never worked out while I was in that particular fast until when I got out of prison and I started getting into bodybuilding. Now, when I got into bodybuilding, I would work out each muscle group twice a week, okay? And I would also work out on that fasted day. And I'll tell you this, I would feel stronger on that fasted day than I did any other friggin' day of the week. And I would be wondering, why do I feel strong like this, stronger than the days where I, I have food in my body? And then I started to remember, when I would do that feast fast method, the reason why I started doing it is because that aided in the release of peptide hormones and testosterone. And I'm like, that's why I feel stronger on that damn fast today than I do on any other day of the week. And that's when I'm doing my intermittent fasting. Now I started getting stronger in the intermittent fasting instead of just doing the feast fast method. Now I do a straight 16-8 all through the week. And then I still have my feast fast method at the end of the week on Saturday and Sunday. And when I'm working out while I'm intermittent fasting, when I'm doing that 16 hour fast, dude, I feel friggin' crazy strong. I actually have broken PRs that I've had while I was working out in a fed state. And the main reason why this happens is because your nervous system is what controls the fat burning process in your body and it also controls the release of testosterone in the body, okay, you guys? And the main reason it controls that is because when you're working out or exercising in a fasted state, your central nervous system has to respond to that so you're able to perform that exercise. So when you're doing cardio in a fasted state, your central nervous system responds by targeting the fat store that are in your body. And when you're actually doing weightlifting in a fasted state, your nervous system has to respond by releasing testosterone in your body for you to be able to have the strength to perform that particular exercise. So for anybody that is out there and you feel the need that you have to have food in your body, that is not the case. That is just a generalistic thing that people say you have to have food in your body when you're lifting weights or you have to have food in your body when you're working out. Now, if you're not used to working out in a fasted state, then I am not sure if you just wanna jump right in to working out while you're in a fasted state because your body is like a computer. If your body is computing that it needs food in order to be able to work out, if you try to work out without having any food in your body, then your body has to respond to it in some kind of way and you might not feel good, you might feel sick, you might feel nauseous, but if you are already intermittent fasting and you're already active, in a fasted state and you start lifting weights and you start doing cardio and stuff like that while you're in a fasted state, your body already knows how to respond while you are in that fasted state. And not only is it going to help you be able to burn fat, but it's also going to be able to help you release testosterone and be able to build strength while you are working out in that fasted state. Okay, you guys. So like I said, if you have not been working out in a fasted state, ease into it. Do not try to go balls to the wall with it because then your body might not respond properly. But if you are already used to intermittent fasting, your body will respond properly. It will target the fat and it will freaking help you build strength and release testosterone in your body. Okay, you guys. So I hope you guys like the video. If you guys like the video, make sure to hit the like button. If you're not subscribed, make sure to subscribe to the channel. And if you guys have any kind of questions, any kind of comments, hit me up in the comment section and I'll be sure to hit you guys up. All right. So I hope you liked the video. Holla at your boy. I swear, I swear. just wait up behind it.